What's up guys, Fetter, and uh, your eyes, ears, and internets are not deceiving you. This is my second commentary in as many freaking days. Holy balls, this is amazing. And uh, as well, actually that wasn't going anywhere, but just like yesterday, got a, got a Moab out here. But this one is a little different. We got a Team Deathmatch Moab. I do not get many of these. I really don't. Um... This just happened to go the right way on some my, one of my favorite maps, Arcade and Arcadian, whatever whatever anyone wants to call this map. I don't know how to pronounce any of the maps in this game. Arcadian, Arcadian, Bakara, Bakara. I really I really don't know. So if you have all of the enunciations down or pronunciations down for all of the Modern Warfare 3 maps, then uh, go I don't know go do something stupid because I don't really care if you practiced. Those names that much, I'm not your friend. But I, uh, I hope you enjoy the gameplay. I enjoyed playing it. This is one of my games where I think I was a little, a little tipsy, a little tipsy, but I uh, managed to pull it out uh, easily. Obviously, the, it's a team deathmatch. Ball, so like, oh my god, you guys! I've never seen one of these before. Uh, SND Moabs. Duh, duh, duh. No, I don't play like that. I, I like to actually get my Moabs. I don't know what happened. Or when it became cool to play like a dirt bag, and by that I mean when it became cool to glitch like I just did there, but when it became cool, as I say for the sixth time, to have your entire team run around and drop ballistic vests and scream at people, and I, I mean I scream at people, don't get me wrong, I scream at everyone that sucks, um, even when I'm in full parties with um, all my friends and stuff like that, I'll end up yelling at someone. But what I'm talking about is... The people that stream on Twitch.tv, Justin.tv, whatever it is they stream on, and how as they go for their Moabs, they camp like this guy. No, they uh, they like to yell at their entire party, no matter who it is, and their entire party has to run support and has to run advanced UAVs and ballistic vests, and so basically they're being given like an endless supply of juggernaut um, while the while no one on their team is stealing their kills, and they're giving them advanced UAVs. Um, throwing down portable radars, all those things, so this person can get their one little measly Moab. And it's kind of hilarious, because if you go to Twitch.tv and you look at the Modern Warfare 3 streams, every one of them has something about, oh, look how many Moabs I have, and I've gotten like 400 Moabs in July, and I have like a thousand lifetime Moabs, and it, I sit there, I kind of look at it, and I, I laugh a little bit, and think it's kind of sad that that's, I guess, what you stream for. Obviously, you stream because you want to entertain people, you know, it's fun. But I'm pretty sure not everyone's supposed to see Moabs all the time, even though we are kind of strange. It seems that we all love to see Moabs explode. Not like we like to see the process of someone getting like 24 kills or 25 kills. We like to see the bomb go off, the screen turn a different color, people die, and then live vicariously through them thinking that, yay, we got, we got a Moab. And right there I was trying to shoot through the wall because I heard this guy. I didn't know if I could actually shoot through the wall or not, so I figured I'd give it a shot with my little silenced pea shooter here but it didn't work and that guy's just an idiot so I don't know how I got away from that but these guys were not very good as you can tell I, I started the game off on a special streak and then just kind of failed for the rest of the match um, until this point but so when it comes to streaming and comes to doing stuff like that I really just don't know um, why people play like that yeah I want to get Moabs and I'd be like hey maybe we should have like a like a pretty even team like you know maybe two of us run specialists two of us run assault two of us run um, support but the two people who are going to be running assault should be people that can actually get like a predator missile and turn that into a bigger kill streak or the people who should be running support should be really focused on you know building up uh, point streaks through capping flags those sorts of things and people who are playing specialists should be really good at getting a lot of kills with their gun and also playing the objective uh, it just it just never works out that way. Uh, if you get lucky, it does. When I play with my friends, it works out fantastically because I'll either run assault or uh, support. Not support. But I never run support. Not every once in a while I'll do it, but I'll run assault and specialist. And a lot of my friends will run. Uh, a lot of them will run support usually because it's just it's just what they do. My friend Vaz Raz and he just literally runs around with RPGs the whole game and just RPGs the crap out of the other team, which is it's quite hilarious to me. And people who camp downstairs, if you camp downstairs, well then fuck you. And, uh, yep, I just swore at you, so be mad, tell your mom. Uh, you might want to mute that part. I, I could give like a warning, warning, patterns about the rage, but I don't really care. So, don't camp down there. But most of my teammates, uh, they'll run assault or they'll run 
<clears throat> they'll run assault or they'll run support. God, I keep getting these all confused. Because I don't think any of my friends have ever gotten a Moab before. So they'll, they'll run specials once in a while. But uh, none of them have ever gotten a Moab. At least the people that I play with um, on a consistent basis. So they just usually run support assault. They like dicking around like I do. And when it's the four of us, no one really takes it too seriously. And usually we can play pretty well. Until the other team starts like camping and I don't know, like seven portable radars. And their whole team throws out six stealth bombers and eight EMPs. Then it's like, alright, you guys are taking this game way too seriously. I'm just trying to kill you to get the mob. And guess what? Oh, I got yo camper in there, biatch. Yeah, take that. So if you want to get those campers, that's the way to get them. And there it is. There it is. TDMO. What, 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 what in the butt? I think it was me and my boy Epic here. I think I was talking. Uh, uh, yeah, it's Epic. Epic Butt Pro. Epic. I don't. How do you pronounce it? Epic Butt Pro or Epic Butt? He's still pro. Um, either way, I was going to ask him if he wanted to do like a dual com. He has his own channel, but I think we'll hold off on that for a while because I'm obviously doing this commentary now. But um, this weekend's going to be busy, so I thought I'd put this up now. I'm going to be moving in with my girlfriend for a little bit, see how this job thing goes, and then we'll figure things out from there. But I hope this is a sign to show you that I am doing more commentaries. And uh, my channel's basically just become a place where if you like me, you can come hang out. If you don't like me, well, go to a bigger channel because... Well, remix, because you're not going to get... I don't know what you're going to get from bigger channels. More douchiness and more, I don't know, something dumb. So, if you guys like me and like my channel, you know, leave a like, stay a, long, uh, stay a while, leave a comment, and I will be back soon. Uh, final score is 40-2 and two in uh, good old TDM mode. So, it's better and enjoy your Wednesday hump day day, and I'll see you soon. Peace!